damn. All right. Damn, I feel like I just got bit by like a whole ass mosquito. But um, I hope you can see me. I hope you can see me. Um, it's the big dog here. It's the big dog here, Hart Jones. Um, Hart Jones, big dog, that's what they call me. <laughs> But um yeah, so every every time I come on, every time I come on, I'm always just really just asking questions. I'm always just asking a whole bunch of questions, right? So right, so I mean, damn. So I have an here's another one. I have another question. Alright, and I'm looking at my arm because whew, right now I got like goosebumps on my arm. Alright. But I have a whole lot of questions, okay? I got a lot of questions right now. Um, it's regarding heat, regarding like everything, because the planet is activating. The planet is in a dance. The planet is heating up. The planet is is um, responding. The planet is under attack. When I say the planet, also think about the sky. The sky is responding. The sky is under attack, right? And right now, everything is in sway. Everything's like in limbo. All right, everything. Understand that right now, everything is in limbo. Um. So yeah. So you know, um, I have a question. I have many, many, many questions. And you know, when you have a question, you can look. You can look. You can look. You can. You can. You can look at the question, and you can say, okay that question the way it's set up has a reference point all right you're gonna say okay I'm gonna jump to this I'm gonna jump to this scholar I'm gonna jump to this scholastic book right so my question is concerning time or is it concerning time at least I think it's concerning time right now we're gonna talk about these dates these dates of uh, scholars, these dates of uh, archaeologists, these dates of geologists, archaeologists, Jesuits, some of which who are exposing and obscuring information, key and vital information. They are obscuring key information, obscuring vital information, right? Let's talk about these dates, right? Well, well, one thing we know is that we are in the year, we're in the year eight. We're in the year eight. It's the year eight. You know, 2018, I said that we was in the year eight. So, you know, like 2018, so I don't, I don't what does that make me? If so, if I ask a whole bunch of questions, what does that make me? I guess at, at you know, in, in the truest sense, in the truest, most sense, I mean, I guess I am an oracle. I'm what you call an oracle. I'm someone who tells you about the past, the present, and the future. Even though I don't know shit, right? And every day, the more I know that I don't know shit, it's like somehow it's like the more, the more energy I tr I attract to my corona, my crown. It's like the more, the more, you know, the more my crown becomes. Uh, becomes encumbered with this knowledge, right? So I'm going to give you this knowledge. I'm dropping you this knowledge. And sometimes I do it in the form of a question, which doesn't sound very scientific at all. Because look, right? Um, and again, my last video, I was just talking about my last video. I was explaining to you how, how the, the Hebrew Bible is talking about nothing about it's, the Hebrew Bible talks about nothing except for mathematics and the way it's brought up, the way it's brought up, the way it, it comes from the ground, the way the way the fountain is is lifted of this mathematical equation or expression is the science of the Bible. It's the science of of the Hebrew B I B L E. It's the science of of um of the science of the word 
it's the science of 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 sound or sight okay if you get me you follow me um I know it's deep so look so look so you have as I'm saying I'm so lost I'm so lost I'm so lost because there's so many different things you know different things we can talk about um <clears throat> and things that is being actually talked about in the media even though we know even though we know it's it's mostly false it's mostly false for example uh this George Floyd guy this George Floyd guy even me saying his name I feel like I'm giving it some type of tribute some type of honor but instead of getting mad about it, I'm going to say, like, yo, guess what? This thing is fishy. And, you know, as as a melanated man, as a melanated person, no matter how melanated you are, as a melanated individual, we should know that it is fishy. There's something fishy about it. So George Floyd was, was brought up this year. It was brought up in the last few months. Let's say the last six months of this year. The year is, the year is, for those watching, the year is 2020. But how did George Floyd pass away in 2017? All right. So George Floyd passes away in 2017. And six months Six months after 2020, we're now we're just now talking about this. So you see what I'm saying? But but my question is, is <clears throat> is the matter even relevant? Is the matter relevant to what's to what's really happening going on right now? I'm going to give you an answer. It might it might be it might be the things that we think is stupid. It may it may have more significance than what we actually no, we actually know and believe. So my thing is, right? If white people are bad, I don't, I don't even know. I don't even want to say white people. If Caucasians are bad, if Caucasians are the devil on earth. If Caucasians are these devils, these Edomites, and everything as the Bible claims. And you know what I'm saying? If they are these things, right? But we are them. We are also Caucasian, right? We are them too. They are they are animals. They are animal. We get we get or I get or you get rather rather you get that Caucasians are animal. They have animal blood. They are not real. You get this. You get this. They are not real men. They are not real men. They are mankind. You get this. Right? But here's the thing. There comes, I was explaining, there comes a part, there comes a time when we have to, when we have to be like, okay, well, um, in, in, the, in the truest form of ourselves, and I know this is this is gonna be obscure. This is gonna sound like sem- semantics, but in the light, in the light, when it comes to being who you are, in the light, you can't compartmentalize. You can't compartmentalize your true nature, right? That's why they say the freaks come out at night. The freaks come out at night. That's what we, the saying goes: the freaks come out at night. Because in a true light, you can't compartmentalize who you really actually are. Really, what we're forced to do is we are forced to improve upon the flaws of mankind and just say, or, or, and just accept, okay, that this, this feeling, this emotion, this thought is an emotion, a thought of, of mankind. It's a, it's a human thought. It's a human emotion it's a human type so I'm looking at this with a mature mind I'm looking at this from from a higher up I'm looking at this from my higher self I'm saying okay this is this is this is a you know there's nothing wrong with this there this is an absolute thing right 
So, and mind you, I'm stuck here, place where I am for a reason. I'm stuck here, place where I am for a purpose, right? My light, my light is needed where it is, where it's at, until that time comes when we uh, when we have to go away, when we have to make our exodus, right? So, my question is, what is real? What is real? What is real? What is fake? It seems as though we are living in the slip of the lie, right? And what is the slip? The slip of the lie is is like piss. It's like piss water. It's like piss water. Okay, we know we're being lied to, and then we know we don't know. So we know. So we we know we're being lied to, and we know we don't know. So then that means we don't know if we're being lied to, but we know we are fucking here, and we are being we are we are being the players. We are being played, and we are playing, right? So I don't know, you know what I mean? Like, I don't, I'm not the type to, to come with you with a lesson or anything because there is no movement, you know what I'm saying? There is no movement for being black. There is no real actual movement for being black. You know, there is no nation for being just being black. The only thing that we can do is sharpen ourselves on an individual status. All right? The only thing we can do is just sharpen ourselves individually. All right? And impress people individually. Right? And show people what we have individually. Right? Whether that's individually or with someone else. or Because sometimes it takes two. Sometimes you need, sometimes you need a helper in order for you to test your theory, in order for you to explore your hypothesis, in order for you to explore. So, you know what I mean? Because agents, agents are gonna be agents. Agents are gonna move however they feel is gonna make them feel safe, right? That's why everyone say, you know, be safe. Everyone's saying, be safe. And and while some wow, so here's here's again again my point is, while some of you believe this corona shit is fake, how fake is it? How fake is this corona? Is it fake enough to not mention? No, corona is not fake enough to not mention. If that was a the case, then I want to have this shit on my neck right now. As you can tell. As you can tell, I got this mask on my neck. All right, and I just ripped it off. I got this mask on my neck. Cause Corona is really real. When I say Corona is really real, I mean like this chapter, this subject that we are, something about Corona is real, whether it's real how you manifest it in your body or how you say how you tell other people, oh yeah, I have I caught corona. And wow, it's you know, it's when it's real when someone's like that and they're coughing and sneezing and they're literally building up corona in their bodies. Or whether it's someone who says corona is fake and how can you catch corona if it's not real? All right, those are all those are that's nothing but a mnemonic or uh, it's nothing but and I don't want to say a, it's an aptitude you know what I mean it's the way you think it's the way you process so when you say corona is fake you're saying well you're showing you're showing that okay well I have a mental aptitude to be able to defeat anything that comes against me now if you say corona is real then you're going to say well you know, well, I'm powerless to Corona. So for someone who's powerless to Corona, if, some, if you believe that you're powerless to a, a, a lesser entity, well, guess what? I'm gonna guess what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take your word for it. I'm gonna take your word for it. Cause you say you are lesser than Corona. You unable to stop Corona, even though it's supposed to be nothing but a common cold with the mortality rate of not even uh what not even three percent 
It's like 3.5%. It's like what mortality, corona can kill only old people and, and maybe children. I'm going to be like, look, I believe you. Stay the fuck away from me because I don't want to catch your fucking way of thinking. You know what I'm saying? But if you say corona is fake, if you say corona is fake, I don't understand why you need to wear a mask. I'm going to be like, I'm going to say, I'm going to say the same exact thing. Like, stay away from me. You are absolutely crazy. You are absolutely a lunatic. All right. You need, you need help. Because one, because if someone believes that they have corona, even though it's a fucking fake, it's like the placebo effect. It's a placebo effect in reverse. Instead of curing yourself, you're going to make your, they're going to make the placebo. The placebo here is make yourself weaker. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be like, yo, I'm gonna like stay away from me with your compromised immune system. All right, because you are a threat to yourself and everyone around you. This is what I'm gonna say. So again, what what are we to talk about? What is to discuss after we? unveil our minds after we lift the hood that's on our minds and our way of thinking what now what is the next step where do we go now what's the next move are we just going to speculate are we just going to observe the earth or are we going to come to a conclusion on what needs to be changed so the way I look at it Right now, being that it's ascension time, I can we can either be talking about the first coming of Christ. We can all come to a consensus on the first coming of Christ. Or maybe talk about the second coming of Christ. Talk about the first coming of Christ. Talk about the second coming of Christ. And what it really means, right? Esoterics of that. Or... We could talk about social, we could talk about socialism, society, and science. We can talk about Pluto, basically Pluto. So we're either going to be talking about, we're going to talk about all things Pluto, or we're going to talk about the first coming of Christ, or we're going to talk about the second coming of Christ. But again, I don't know anything. So rather than beating Rather than beating a horse, a dead horse with a stick, you know, again, just saying, okay, well, I'm superior than you. Like, okay, yeah, fine. Okay, granted, everyone knows this. Granted that you told the maximum amount of people that you can possibly tell. What are we going to do? What, what's, what, what is going to Stop. What is going to kill the agents? What is going to kill the agents? What is going to kill all of these slave catchers, right? Because they, right now there is a standing army that makes sure that we are all in uniform, uniformity, uniformity, uniform line. What are we going to do? What are we going to do against the standing army that, you know, against the standing army? What are we going to do? Where are we going to be at? All right. And you know who I am right now? Right now, I am I am like the Care Bear. I'm like the Care Bear kid. I'm like the Cabbage Patch. Care Bear motherfuckers. And I'm be honest. I'm a Care Bear motherfucker. I'm a Cabbage Patch kid. That's who I fucking ride with. I ride with the Cabbage Patch kids. So it's me and my Cabbage Patch troop. Me and the Care Bear troop is asking, what the fuck is you gonna do? Now, niggas is trying to... Niggas is trying to attain godly powers and niggas is trying to obtain, you know black magic powers and ungodly powers but that shit's not working quick enough 
for me and the Cabbage Patch kids, me and the Cabbage Patch crew, who's trying to feed ourselves every day, feed ourselves, feed our bodies every fucking day. And I'm not just saying do it. I'm not just saying do it, but do it. Do it in the light. Do it in the light of not being able to compartmentalize ourselves. Not being able to take a hot shower when you fucking need having to be dirty. Having to literally be dirty all day. Because you ain't got no other fucking choice to. Having to still be exiled from... This, that, and the third, being exiled from your mind, being exiled from your thoughts. So, what are we gonna do? I'm talking about for me and the Cabbage Patch crew, because when you a part of something, you can't just up and leave something, right? When you a part of something, you can't just up and leave something. We all have something that we can't just up and leave, right? We all have something we can't just up and leave. Even if a lot of us already left our families, even if a lot of us already left our homes, we have something that we can't just up and leave, up and walk away from. A lot of the shit that we have is just new, is new, is new shit that we just conquered. It's new conquests. A lot of the shit that we have is new conquests. So what's the spirit that we're going to ride with into this new year, into this new millennium, into this 13th Baktun? Because right now we're in the 12th box tunes, ending really soon. It's ending December 21st. So are we just reliving time again? No, I don't know. We're not reliving time again. Something, Something's coming up. We're coming to a head. We're coming to a head. All right, but I'm, 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 I'm your boy, the Oracle. This is the Heartstone Jones, man. Drop a comment. Leave a comment. All right. Um, make sure you study. Make sure you study up, you know. When you get when you when you when you find a moment to study up. You know, when you're done with that, make music. And after you make music, go outside, get some air. You know. Go outdoors. You can't say whether indoors is real or outdoors is real. You know what's real? Real is real. Reality all the time. That's real. You can't compartmentalize certain shit. I can't. I can't. I can't practice rituals. I can't practice my rituals in all the places. I can't. I can't practice rituals in all the places that I fantasize. Something start when you walk in through that door. Something start when you walk on the surface of that ground, and something stop when you work, walk on the surface of that ground. I got a lot of questions. I got a lot of questions because been here, done this shit so many fucking times. Been here, been there, done that. Been there, done that. Been there and done that. I'm tired of the same old, same old. Now we're just doing this same shit and just in a different way. What about it? We's gonna get old. What about it? Prometheus. Tell me about Prometheus. What the fuck is Prometheus? What is Prometheus really? But I'm out. Sleeping y'all some questions. Leave a comment. Drop your comments. Drop your thoughts. Help me help me find a topic to talk about. Help me find a topic to talk about. Cause from down to, to necromancy, down to necro necromancy, down to everything. Everything down from necromancy. From necromancy to the stars, the heavens, the planets, you know, the signs and the houses. What do we talk about? What's to talk about? What's next? What's next?